Coach, obviously this uh, year of uh, learning and growth and patience, but after games like this and uh, the game against Utah last week that wasn't very competitive, how do you manage to just keep positive about all this? It don't have to all be positive. <laughs> no, and it won't be positive tomorrow in the film session. Coach, in that first half, you guys are struggling offensively. How tough is it when you don't necessarily have one of those mature guys who can kind of just take over when you're in a scoring drought? No, it's definitely something that's missing off the roster, but we can't let missing shots affect our defense, and that's exactly what happened. I think we were 0 for 12 from 3, and, uh, you know, it just we ended up caving in defensively because we couldn't put a shot in the basket. Uh, just with Dennis, uh, did he look like he was moving the same way, or is he uh, a little rusty? rusty. With the... A little rusty. And, uh, you know, I think, too, you know, he had a good practice yesterday. And, you know, I'm sure some of that lingered into the game as well because it's a conditioning factor, as, you know, also. Um, you know, but we've got to get him out there and get his legs back under him. Coach, after what you just told me, are you concerned that the team is not maybe where you would have liked them to be by now as far as progressing? No, I didn't have a necessarily a point like some map that I thought we were supposed to hit these bullet points and you, you just can't go about it that way with kids. You don't know what's, you know, how they're going to respond to things. My thing is just constantly them getting back into the trench, competing and trying to get better. And that's all I'm worried about.